Mosin Nagant, 1891. Weighing in at 9.5 pounds with an overall length of 51.5 inches, this is one of the most well-known rifles of the Great War. Long, hefty, and with that balance point forward to the magazine, you definitely feel that poundage as the day goes on. Stripping 5 rounds of 7.62x54mm R to her is a task. I might not have to worry about rimlock with this guy, but sometimes that cartridge interrupter is a pain. The cock and open action is expectedly stiff, and many of these guns can be described as rubbery, likely a combination of having too many operating surfaces while also having loose tolerances between each of them. And don't get me started on that mushy trigger pull. The safety is heavy but simple, just pull back and rotate the cocking piece. The wrist is pleasantly thin, although the very first production model had a metal finger rest. That would have been nice. The ladder sights are decent, and recoil? Pretty comparable to 30-06. In the end, I personally enjoy some Mosin time. As a hobby. If you'd like to know more, subscribe to see an arsenal.